Hello guys, today I'm going to show you how to install uh, folder games, like eight, or games that come in like multiple zips or whatever. So like disc based games and how to play them. So firstly, you're going to want to have multi-man, multi-man will work. Or if you want to make it easier on yourself and you don't have to go into multi-man all the time, you can install webman mod which will be which will be good and it's really good you should also have this installed anyway so yeah you can download both of them i already have them installed but you should know how to install pkg if you know the basics of a playstation 3 and it's seen so i'm just gonna say i just want to say i legally own this game on multiple other multiple platforms and this is not a guide to pirate uh, it really, I'm just saying that so the YouTube bot won't take the video down. I doubt it will even get taken down anyway, but yeah. So you'll usually have a video, uh, I usually have one, but that will be called part or whatever. This is just the way I've formatted it. So this is sort of ways. So what you want to do is you want to have a file extractor like 7-zip or WinRAR. I'll leave a link to that in the description, or you can go to this website and download it. This is their official website. This will also probably work on Linux. You can use their uh, extractor like P7-zip or whatever. So you just want to right click it and then click 7-zip and then click extract here. Or you want to hover over 7-zip, you don't need to click it. But yeah, extract here. Hello guys, uh, so it's finished, so you'll have this side, uh, don't worry, you can find, you can look at the file, but it's just all the game stuff, so what you want to do, you'll have this folder, just want to say, you should drag it, so now, I'm just going to show you, so you just want to drag it onto your flash drive, it can be anywhere in your flash drive, you can make a folder, if you want to call it a folder uh, games, you can run it off the flash drive, but it might be a bit slower than running off the hard drive, so I'm just going to show you now. So it's Guys, taken a while. It I'm back. Take a while. Uh, so it's on my flash drive. So what you want to do now is come down here and click on the fl click on the flash drive and click eject. USB flash drive on the one you have. So now just unplug your flash drive. Unplug it into your USB port on your PlayStation 3. So now I'm going to go over to the PlayStation 3. As you can see. Now we're just going to go over to my homebrew and then launch multi-man so this will work on hand thing you can also follow this along on ftp or whatever this will i should have said at the start this will also work on ftp so as you can see it is detected so just go into it and then Go on to your HGD zero, then go to games. And then over here you want to go into USB, you should see your file. Click cut or p copy if you want, I don't know, whatever you want to plan to do. And then we're going to click yes. Because then it should have transferred over. As you can see, it's transferred over. Let's just click and paste it. If you look in your games, it might show up already. Oh, yeah, I just saw it. As you can see, it's here. So if you press triangle, you can press load. I'm just going to do to show you. And it will say verifying data for a little while. So I don't know if it will try to auto kick us into the game. 
but as you can see, here's the game. So what I recommend you doing is press in triangle and check for update. Just saying, it, it doesn't matter if you're banned from PlayStation Network, don't worry. It won't actually matter. Well, that just zoomed, honestly. So as you can see, if you want to, you can press this. Oh, you might have to refresh it. Like, I mean, refresh the games. Oh. As you can see, the game is loading fine. So you can you can go play whatever. If you want to mod, uh, I mean, if you want to play online, you can. I doubt there'll be anyone playing this game, but it works as any game if the servers are still up. Do you like to test drive? Uh, nah. So, you can play whatever. I'm just gonna play a single race to show you it's working fine. Yeah. Yeah, well, Lagoon's fine. Oh yeah, we can see that ultimate Mimi. But yeah. Obviously, I do not condone piracy and I legally own this game. But yeah. So, I don't have my audio recording, but yeah. As you can this see could also be good for working. this. Um, as, you know, if you if you do retro game collecting, this is also pretty good if you want to preserve your games. You can back it up to your hard drive. As you can see, the game's fully working fine. So, as you can see, that worked, and I just want to say, thank you for watching, I'm sorry if this took a little while, I don't know, it took a long time for me to watch, but yeah, bye bye, thank you for watching.